let's reach into our beautiful Nom Nom grocery bag and see what's cooking today. We have sour cream, green onions, sounds good, bacon, crescent roll dough, vegan eggs, garlic, some cheese, that's pepper jack, brown mustard, American cheese. Oh, and that's it. What could we be making? Could it be a breakfast pie? I'm gonna start with some green onions sliced up. Put that in our bowl. Shake up our vegan eggs. It's gonna be kind of like a quiche a little bit. We're gonna add some dairy, our sour cream, give it a little tang. My little bit of leftover pepper jack cheese. I'm gonna throw in some American cheese as well, just shred it up. I'm gonna go through three slices of American. Let's add some cloves of garlic. Garlic can go with breakfast flavors, guys. I feel like a lot of people overlook that, but it does. A little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper. Classic egg combination. Some Cholula. Oh yeah. Mix it up. Now we can chop our bacon. Let's get this cooked up. If I can get it in my hand. A little tricky. Carry it over to the stove. Throw it in the cast iron. Just want to get a bunch of little crispy, nice bacon bits out of here. And we're not going to throw away that oil. Put the bacon into our egg mix, our pie filling, and then we're going to oil a little mini baby cast iron here. Just enough to get it nice and non-stick, you know. And impart some flavor to our croissant roll dough that is going to be the dough, the crust of our pie. So gently kind of work it out, stretch it out. Make sure you get it all up on the edge. And then I use some of the spare dough to fill in the gaps where the perforations were. This will take you a minute, but it's worth taking the time to do it. Do it right. You don't want any holes. This will make a lovely, soft, buttery crust. Now I'm just going to smooth a little bit of our mustard, spread a little bit of our mustard all over this dough. And that's going to contrast the more fatty flavors of the filling and just give you this nice sharp note to the whole pie. I love it. Add in our filling. Just barely fits. Perfect. There we go. Looking, well maybe not looking good yet, but it will once we cook it. And I have my oven preheated to 350. After putting a little bit more pepper on top, I'm going to throw this in the oven, and it's going to cook for about an hour. I realized I needed to cover the edges with foil, so I did that about halfway through. I wouldn't burn those edges. But it's looking good now. Nice little browning on the top. It smells amazing like bacon and onion. Moist in the center crispy on the edge comes out a little bit messy it ends up being you know a bit of a, a casserole but man is it a good breakfast if I can even get it out <laughs> that crust though mm. you guys got to try having this for breakfast look at that golden brown and if you like this recipe or any of my others, 
please make sure you like this video, subscribe, share it. I really appreciate you guys watching. I hope you got some tasty ideas.